Hi there Virgo, I'm Jennifer Angel, these are your stars for December. Um, you have a lunar eclipse in your uh, career zone, so if you're looking for change at the office, then this is the month that's going to happen. Even if you're not looking at it, it's likely to happen, okay, because with moon energy and particularly an eclipse when it's a full moon lunar eclipse, uh, it really shakes things around. It's intense energy. So um, you may not be able to be as prepared as you like to be because as a Virgo you like to have everything set out, organized, and all of a sudden as soon as you get that, someone up the ladder, higher, um, you know, superior level is likely to come down and say, well, we're going to do it all differently now, okay? Now remember Virgo, hard work does pay off. Um, and you do have Saturn, you know, sitting in your career, in your financial zone rather, which means hard work uh, is likely to still be on your plate, but it will pay off. And I, I want you to remember that nothing stays the same forever. In fact, the only thing that you can um, rely upon in life is that there will be change. And that's what's happening at the moment. It's almost like you're going to be forced to make some changes. So. Um, Try not to, the advice I really want to give you here is try not to prejudge anything, okay? I mean, wait until it all settles down. I mean, sometimes the, what, what you think is the biggest drama in your life ends up being the best blessing in disguise, okay? But you have to just wait until the pieces fall into place, the dust settles and all the pieces of the jigsaw sort of fit in together and then you can make your judgment and see what's how it all sits and uh, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. Now the same with your love life or your personal life at the moment. Um, it's likely that you're going to be uh, asked or forced to move out of your comfort zone. Now this is not a bad thing because if love has gone into the doldrums a bit, uh, perhaps just a little bit too much routine and the passion's gone, um, you want to just you know, spice it up. And remember, as you change, your relationships also change and you have to change with them. So although it may seem confronting at first, it can be incredibly empowering um, once that you do go with it and go out of your uh, comfort zone. Okay, so great things happening. Um, it's a really good month to end the year for you and do come back and see what's in store for the year ahead and uh, thanks for listening and we'll see you next month. Bye.